Queen Sweetie here. Please like and subscribe. Okay. Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm just double checking everything in OBS. Looks great. So, I'm back. I'm waiting for a long distance party on my other player. No one's offering it. So, um, one, this is Queen Sweetie 6. I forget who I was actually one. Was it four, five, whatever? Okay, so that's done. Uh, AO is doing AO week. So, you can level up really fast. In fact, I was level 100 and on another character and I'm already 120. And it's only been two days. It's just really, really interesting. Um, so that's that. The other thing is I figured out that this event package lasts to level 81. Um, to get a house, you need a hundred thousand gold and level 80 as well. Your upgraded archer and viking do not count as a chef, so you actually have to go hire or, you know, recruit one. And I can show you that later. Then, um, gold thread. They ask for a lot of gold thread. And so, yeah. So, I did all of this. Or, God, crafting is making my thing pop up. The other great thing to do, and that's why I'm in town, let me check here. Buy material. I guess spell it right, that helps. Okay. Material box. What is it? Is it extra? Inventory? License. Permanent. Yes. It allows you to use the four bags. I do not quite have enough gold yet, but as soon as you can get one of these, it will greatly help. I hit level, let me think, 50. And I hit level 60. So that's why I got level 60 armor. I already have my level 50 stuff on. That's how fast I'm leveling. It's crazy. Um, you get like Dark Knight equipment boxes. You get bronze crystal or castle equipment boxes. You get two of these so far, which you get actually more than that down the road. And these are nice mercs. In fact, I'm going to summon two of them now. I am going to actually get a Rang, because her aura will help me. And then I, oh, Warlord would be good too. You can get Rin, you can get Guan. Anyway, I'll show you these guys real quick. So, class. Main character. The Knight, I can show you what a Valkyrie is nice, because of her quickening. It gives you more action power, so you can then shift, or uh, I think it's either guard or F, G or F, and then you can get your main and you can attack again. So it's nice that way. That's her. That's one. Um, Rin. Okay, Dragoon Reaver. That's Reaver. Okay, here's the general. He, his green rage weakens range enemies. So if you have range in your party, it's nice. And also his green dragon AOE is really nice too once you have him leveled up. So that's why he's nice. Then there is... Sorry, I was making sure I was recording because sometimes it set, I think I did and I didn't. But uh, Rifleman Marksman. Okay, here's... Here's a harang, and then this is 
for Aurora. It increases long range mercenaries attack power and combo. It's passive magic, so it automatically like casts and you can see Bo is in there. So it does help her. Um, once you hit level, I think it's 120. I think you can learn other magic. 100 is piercing arrow. And then after that, 120 is your upgrade quest. And then you, from there, you can get more magic. And what that is one of the magics. Um, you can find out when you do main character. This is how you can know. Oops. Main character. Celestial Hunter. So, you can get Concentrate, which only helps Marie. You can get her Aurora. You can get Emperor, Empress Blessing, which is nice. And it is a nice one. And Throne's Fury. Um... The difference between that and an actual, oh, where are you, marksman, is what? Huh. Maybe my enemy? I'm not sure if these are part of the 120. I would think they would be down here, so pretty much they have the same. Okay, I was not expecting that. Okay, cool. So, yeah, that's why... I I'm pretty sure I have this on my 170 main. I mean, Empress Blessing, that's nice if you are PvP. Because then that dispels people's magic that casts on you. Like if they have a Shenhong, they can easily debuff you and um, bring make you weaker. So that's great for that. But Aurora is the way to go because it actually increases your attack power and combo rate. So that's what I want to go for then later. Um, what else? Warlord is great. I wanted to show you him. That's right. He is a knight. Uh, his rally. Boost main character attack power defense critical and intelligence. Passive again. Also demoralize steals an enemy leader. And they got to be a boss. And drains mana from him. And also decreases attack power and defense. He is great in Merlin. Or the Avalon dungeons. And many say if you have an Arthur in him. You can double seal or a Grim and double seal. And I'm talking about the horse Grim. Not the brothers. Uh, Leech. Whatever you call him. That they both can double seal him. And then you can attack like crazy and not get hurt. I just haven't done that. And... I have found that having my Rin and Hippo with a bow main is definitely gives you attack power. I just haven't found the right combination yet. So, still working on that. So, that's Warlord. He takes an orb instead of a shield. So, that helps his, with his magic. Uh, who else? Rin. Rin is a Reaver. No, she's not. She's a Power Salt, and I never can remember... Who they are. Berserker? Yeah, Puppeteer is Rin. Uh, this is the spell that everyone loves. You can give yourself a second turn. And in doing so, it increases their abilities. And it also, if you are stunned, you can take her, cast that on to yourself. It gets rid of your stun. And even um, uh, freeze... I think it took away, as I, I know in TBS, it took away a person, um, it's what the druid does with uh, the roots, and it seals you. It's like freeze, but seals you. Uh, these are some of her other things. Who else? I have Dark Arthur. I kept Dark Archer in because she's another person of sight, so she's nice. Oh, Shin Hong. Who are my Stormcrawlers? Yeah, there she is. This is the spell I was talking about before. It Enemies to take more damage from range attacks. Targets take damage every turn, especially on targets suffering magical fire. I have no idea what that means, but okay, cool. 
So there's that. That uh, curses an enemy, reducing health and attack power. Um, this bloody hand to crush enemies fighting spirits. Enemies hit with the skill take damage and lose action power. Huh. I don't know if you can get both off, but that would really weaken them. So she's great for that. She's whip, so she's ranged. So she also attacks range-wise. Okay, so that's that. So I am going to go ahead. No room in your formation. Ooh, okay. So I gotta actually fire someone? Uh, let's get rid of this bell. Yes. And I'm going to fire this mage. Okay, so I am going to get Rin right away. Recruit. Yes. And she is your level. That's nice. And then I am going to get... Ooh, this is where my... Hmm. Who do I get? Well, I want war Warlord for sure. So we'll get them too. And then as I get more of them summing, summons, which I do, I will add them to my thing. I don't think I've increased her spells because this is a new character. So there's that. Warlord needs armor. Okay, I thought I put armor on. Oh, these are level 60. That's why. Okay. So he takes a sword. So we're just going to do melee box. Sword. Confirm. All right. Since I got Rin as well. Do that with her, so that way she is taken care of and can be in the front line. She takes a power saw then, which is down here, and I can't select it. Oh, you're annoying me. Go away. Thank you. All right. Power saw. And upgrade her armor. No, that's spirit. That ain't going to help her. Oh, it'll sort of help her. Okay, so now we're going to go save the oracle. Let me check my formation. Okay, put her there. Get rid of him. And I have a sword here. Who, who does what? Because one of the swordsmen does... Ra uh, thunderbolt. Okay. I can't tell who's who. Well, hopefully he's the one. Okay. Anyway. So, click this, and boom. Um, also, the last box you get is one level 110. So, maybe I need to actually go into this portal. Oh, right. What do we got here? Ooh. Oracle, I'm here to save you. No, run, it's a trap. All right. It's a trap, everyone. Complete. And, of course, I level. Battle with the Atlantean. Okay, so now I'm level 167. Oh. Did I just tele re-teleport? Yep. I was inside the whole time. So we need the oracle to save somebody. Person in Okay, so stop. Yeah, I think he was the one with the thunderbolt. 
Nope. He has Shield Bash. Ouch. Oh, that's right. I was like, this happened last the last time. I'm like, oh no! How am I supposed to beat him? You're just supposed to attack him. It doesn't say to beat him. It says battle with him. So that's going to happen to you. Do not worry about it. All right. Your water of life revives everybody. So then you can hit complete with that. Oh yeah, I forgot. I went too fast. Neil, my friend, I have a gift for you. So I got to hit X. And then you see how the times to here in the experience. That is Atlantica Online. Uh, day, week, going on. You have bonus time effect of 200 plus percent experience that you normally don't have. And when you are in a party of three, that experience that you get on your when you're attacking is times three as well. But I'm not doing that because I will majorly level up and I am already going to do that. So I got to hit X. That's it. I'm kneeling and she knows it from here. All right. Complete. Ooh, I got a queen's gift. Return to the Maya Empire. I don't know how to make that not lock. Stay hidden. That too were same big. Okay. Guard captain dot dot dot. How was that? How was the trip? Okay. Come on, we have to get Kali right away. He, where is he? Kali, we can save you now. After all I put you through, Kali passed while you were gone. Oh no! That, that can't be. He died peacefully if it's any consolation. Not really. I'd be fumed right now. Okay. You are too late, he passed away. I'm sorry. Better be. I got a bow with your arrow. Your name on it. Um, you've been through so much to find the Inca Oracle. Oracle, yeah. I can't see. I can see it in your eyes. In the end, we could not save him. The new high priest said he wanted to talk to you. He's waiting you at the high priest chamber. So we're going there. One. All right. Ah, oh, welcome, child. I am afraid the temple is closed. We are mourning. You see, up oh, you could it be? You're the one Kali spoke of. Before he passed, he left a message for you. You are to leave the empire and explore the world. Ah, uh, and this is the Inca Oracle, my dear Oracle. You would. If you would accompany my friend further, we would forever be in your debt. Uh, okay, I'm supposed to recruit an oracle. So let's do so, everyone. Queen Sweetie, I'd like to go with you. I think I can do more good by your side than I can staying here. All right. We got a healer. I guess he did put his stuff in the trial. I asked my son to do something. Oh, yes. And hit the light blue bow. See? I think I'm going to take it. Because the plus nine, the dexterity and all that is higher. This can go to you, my friend. Oh, she had, had one? Yeah, she already had one. Okay, I'll keep that. When I get to level 70. Um. Alright. Oh, you are level. Whatever. I can't see. 68. God crash keep popping up my other screen. The, the oracle has incredible healing power. This is driving me nuts. Alright. Why? I've seen oracles use magic to knit shut 
magic to knit shut their allies' wounds on the battlefield. And let me tell you, no enemy is quite so terrifying as the one who's been embedded, embedded with the Oracle Seth's will spell. Mm -hmm. Now, before I forget, this is Callie's last gift to you. Fully hear your characters, yes. Oh, I got a necklace. You bought... You've brought our three peoples together in ways I've never thought possible. Close that, please. Oh, invasion time. I got it. I will show you. Let's see, display capture? Yeah. She's going to go attack. So you can watch that down in the corner. All right. Now as... To Callie's last wish, there is a whole wide world for you to explore. I don't want to be there. Okay, so where are you going to take me? Talk to that person. Shezharazade? Okay, travel there now. All right. I want to be here. All right. Oh, that's right. Ugh. I got sand in my mouth. So this is Baghdad. Not bad. There we go, everyone. We are in Baghdad. Um, going out to town because this is where mobs spawn for the invasion. I am talking to you. Okay. I just need to see something. I'm at 21. I can show you a few battles with these guys. I got to get, oh, I've, I've completed the quest. Okay. I just want the um, historical essence, voice of terror, and Rydarian soul stuff. So that's why I'm attacking. They're on auto battle. Yes. A strain ominous energy flows from the hanging gardens of Babylon. I am certain this energy is the cause. However, it's too dangerous to venture inside unprepared. How? Okay. Besides, the animals around the place don't take kindly to our presence in the area. The wise foxes are attacking anything and everything that come near them. So we got to go defeat the wise foxes. And as they are consumed by raging madness. Um, also, you could see... On the corner, the bottom left hand. Um, as I attack mobs, you can see the three times experience. If I can get something, can't join that battle. I can join that one. All right. So watch. See, it says times three, and then it has the experience there. So AO day is really awesome for that reason. So we gotta kill fifteen wild foxes. And uh, this will get us to level 100, and then I will show you the Sea of Clouds quest that you need to do to get your on um, your spell piercing arrow. Um, it's a special sealed book that you need to get, and then once you get that book, you can upgrade your other spell. You can increase the spell. So there's that. I also want to show you. Oh, she's in the front. She needs to come to the back. I also want to show you how possibly you can Atlas her spell because it is a lot of money to get. So you know what? We're going to do this. And then attack. Okay. Now, I'm not level 130, so I cannot complete the other quests that um, are our invasion, but um, once I get this character leveled up a little bit, because these invasion mobs are pretty serious, then I will show you invasion quests, and you can get a title from that as well, a really good one. It's 40% attack power, so yeah, it's really quite nice. But these are the foxes and whatnot. Uh, hearts give you a more buff. Did I need already? Okay, formation. 
Let's move you to the back. Our defense is better than his. And that defense is better than his. Okay. Go attack. Also, invasion gives you like crazy experience at the end. So and it's really nice if you are leveling up. I took a muscle relaxer, so that's why I'm tired. That's for spell. For one spell. I gotta get rid of it so it doesn't keep killing me. Um, it gives her more stuff. It's called Bloody Stream. And don't need it. Alright, I'm going to pause this until I can get 15 minutes. Yeah. So, um, we should be getting 15 here, of course. It's more than two. But, um, I did take off her auto battle. She will not cast that now that she's on auto battle. And before when I was recording her, I d I leveled up her skills evenly, and I realized the one I don't need to. Um, the agile one, I think. I'm not sure if that one will give me will make her like auto attack. And I'm nervous to use that in um, when we do the ND of Avalon. So now I need thread. That's silver thread. So, but I am going to um, stop recording and then um, well, let me show you quick the invasion. So I'll bring this over here and just turn that off. Um, this is Pharaoh's Curse Invasion. She's level 120 already. I just started her way a little bit ago. That's how crazy insane Atlantica Day is. She's, like I said, invasion mobs are no joke. So she has some plus 10 stuff on, and so does, uh, my front line. And they're dying, of course, because they're now leveling up to 120. So it kind of messes everything up. So you can see how when I attack. Okay, so that was that battle. And um, they gained like 7 mil experience both because they were dead. Everybody else was dead. Oh. Oh. So yeah, I gotta go then, and this is what invasion, so you gotta kill people, mobs, and once they hit 10,000, then it'll end, and you either defeat it, or you don't. So, uh, this one is pretty easy to defeat, and I just want to try to show the next, um, experience now. See, now we all got nine, and she got one, because... I think she died. Yeah, Taylor's my dark archer. So that's that. Uh, so see you next time.